Highways 30 and 83 intersect in North Platte, and Interstate 80 runs through the south part of town. 24,733 people are proud to call North Platte their home. William F. Cody arrived on the scene in 1878, and he had a lot to do with the steady rise of North Platte. He was born in LeClaire, Iowa in 1846. He went on to become a soldier, bison hunter, and showman. In the mid-1880s, he moved his family to North Platte and called it his home. The mansion was built back in 1886 for the cost of $3,900. And here it stands today, an 18-room priceless treasure. It brings a lot to the community. Um, you know, most people think of North Platte, they think of two things, Buffalo Bill Cody and the Union Pacific Railroad. Back in the 1860s, William Cody earned the nickname Buffalo Bill Cody because he was the one that went out and hunted buffalo to feed his fellow Union Pacific workers. A born entertainer, Buffalo Bill went on to become a millionaire as he entertained millions of people around the world with his Wild West show. Our visitation uh, annually, we have about 7-8% of our visitations from out of country, most of those Europeans, because uh, Cody spent, you know, majority of his time with his Wild West show was, was spent over in Europe. Cody's 30-year run got underway in Omaha in 1883. Performers included Sitting Bull and Annie Oakley. And here's solid evidence of just how popular Buffalo Bill's show was. After Thomas Edison perfected the motion picture camera, Edison chose Buffalo Bill Show to be his first subject. Through the magic of Thomas Edison, we hear Buffalo Bill himself in 1898. Ladies and gentlemen, permit me to introduce to you a congress of the rough riders of the world. His show was truly extraordinary boasting at its peak a traveling company of more than 200 performers. I'll tell you a little bit about the dining room. Riggins uh, says there are a number of reasons why people enjoy touring the mansion. We've got a wealth of memorabilia and just the house itself to see the architecture of the house. You know, everything's pretty much original. You know, it, it looks like it's still lived in. You walk inside and, and you can maybe picture Buffalo Bill and his wife still living here. Long before the Wild West show, Buffalo Bill was an Army Scout, and he had always hoped to retire here at his North Platte residence. That's why he named it Scout's Rest Ranch. Unfortunately, Cody ran out of money and ended up living in Cody, Wyoming, until he passed away in 1917. This great American icon was 70 years old.